The European Commission, the executive arm of the European Union, has approved three billion euros in financial aid to help build four major highways in Greece. Construction on the highways has been halted over the past few years as the country has grappled with a severe debt crisis that's required big budget cutbacks. But don't worry, good people of Greece, the EU kleptocrats are riding into town on their bronze bull. We know you're hungry, we know you're homeless, we know you're jobless, but it's all good. We bring you heap big money with which you must build roads. Can I just say that I love this term, the executive arm. What a play on words. What is the chief executive of a corporation? He's the overall lead decision maker, right? OK. And the executive board of directors? Well... That's right, the most senior decision makers. But who elects these people to the board? And is there any kind of workers' election? No. Nothing wrong with that in a company or privately owned corporation. It's an enterprise, so there is no need for a representation of the people or democracy. But the European Parliament says it wants to be democratic and representative of the people. But the kleptocrats speak with forked tongue. Because the EU Commission, its executive arm, as we've just discovered, is unelected, self-appointed, it's basically a board of directors. They have the real power and are accountable only to themselves and cannot be removed by the people. Well, until that structure is corrected, we have no freedom. We are merely serfs to a dictatorial master.